I'll tell you another thing I don't know. This year I'm thinking of getting either one. You may not know this, but I'm gonna fish. It was a clean, crisp morning, my destiny. News Center's Bob Elliott claimed to have a twin brother who called himself Elliott Spade, Private Eye. And Bob liked to keep him busy with a case now and then. In 1988, Spade went in search of family in the York County town that bears their name. It was 92 degrees, the caddy was ready to boil, and the last place I wanted to be was in Elliott, Maine. One look at the town and I knew something was out of whack. Sure, they had all the right signs, Elliott Meat, Elliott Drug, Elliott Commons, but here's the rub, there's no one in town named Elliott. We've got lots of spinnies, lots of staples, but no Elliots. Well, I've been here now 20 years and I haven't seen any Elliott people here. Where can I find some? Elliot's around here. Never heard of any. I was getting nowhere fast, obviously. These jokers were lying through their teeth, but why? I checked the phone book, no Elliot's. I checked the graveyard, no Elliot's. And worse, someone even put the gag on the town's historian. I don't know of any Elliot's that ever lived in this town. These clowns obviously had me pegged as a rookie gumshoe. I know for a fact the Elliots settled this town, fought the Indians, even played for the Marshwood football team. Would they expect me to believe they just vanished? It just doesn't add up. Probably never will. But that doesn't make it right. Kinfolk is kinfolk and mine are gone. I wandered the streets for hours, no answers, until finally I got a lead. Winnie's Diner, a cook by the name of Williams. I offered money, he balked, so I played my trump. 12 pictures of Peggy Kaiser. Then he spilled his guts. I'll tell you the truth. There's something funny going on in this town. I like the movie The Stepford Wives. I think we've got all the Elliots locked up someplace. Back at City Hall, they tried to buy me out of town with an honorary citizenship. Be it resolved that on this 23rd day of June, 1988, the Board of Selectmen would like to make Robert Edward Elliott an honorary citizen of the town of Elliott, Maine, for his exemplary services to the town. Congratulations. Real touching, but I wasn't buying it. I can't solve this case now. We're at the end of the show, but I'll come back. And when I do, I'll find out who took the Elliots out of Elliott, Maine. Good thing we got color TV since 1988. I, yeah. I, I, I love the kid with the saxophone <laughs> at the baseball field. So funny. That was awesome.